Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel for another tutorial. Today guys, I'm going to be covering a mid to high skin fade. Uh, we keep in the top as it is. My client is growing his hair. I've already did the shape up and then second step, we're going to be working on mid to high skin fade, starting by putting a baseline first and then we're going to use a shaver to board up completely the bottom part and then we're going to start a process for a skin fade. Guys, I'm going to be using my Babyliss Skeleton FX to put the baseline just about a finger length above the ears. I'm going to drop it toward the back. So now guys, now I put the baseline, I'm going to follow it by Andy's foil shaver to completely fold out this bottom part here. I'm using a circular motion to blend to the baseline, don't want to leave any harsh line that would be difficult to remove afterward. Also want to mention guys, if all barbers are based in the UK, if you're looking to get any tools, equipment, products, uh, anything, it's available on a link on my Instagram bio and it gives you a 10% discount each time you use the link. So the first step we're going to be doing is using a number one and half and it's open. This is just to kind of set the foundation for us to see what we blend into. And one and a half close. And so that basically leave us from so we got one and a half on the top and then zero on the bottom. What we want to do is fade or blend from zero to a number one and half. On this tutorial guys, what I'm going to be using is the metal classic guard, which is this one. And I'm, this is what allow me to skip the 0.5 guard, which is not going to be using it. So in the whole fade, what we're going to be working on is using the blade and the number one classic guard. And my first step would be a first guideline, which is the blade fully open and the second step is the number one classic guard and it's fully open to blend right to the number one and half close And then number one, close to remove the middle line. So as you see guys here, all what we've got left is the skin line. So I'm going to use the blade fully closed to remove it. So sometimes guys, you might need to go back and use the trimmer. The first trimmer that you set the guideline with the baseline with, which is was a skeleton FX, to remove that baseline. So at this point guys, I'm just going to use the blade or the corner of the blade and then that will be open, close, halfway open, depends where I'm going to be detailing them.
So I'm gonna. So my next step is I'm gonna go and do the shape up on the C cut, and then after that is done, I'm gonna go back and do a bit of touch up on the fit. Well, as you remember, we used a number one and a half open and close, and then we set the baseline, and then the second step we did a uh, first guideline, which is the blade fully open or lever open. Then we used the metal classic guard to blend between the uh, blade open to the number one and a half close, and then we followed it by a number one close and then the blade close to remove a skin line. It's pretty much simple and straightforward technique allows you to skip the 0.5 guard and the reason why I'm skipping 0.5 guard because I'm using a classic metal guard and allows me to skip between these two. Also it depends how you use your clippers uh, allows you to skip those guards.